John upstairs in the media center, Mark Spector, Sportsnet. Go ahead. Yeah, Jason, um, your, your team has played a certain style all the way through here and you've played it very well and stuck, you know, with other than some penalties, you've been a pretty disciplined team, the way you play, it all gets away from you tonight. You don't even look much like the Dallas stars in the second period at all. Uh, What happens? We regroup and go on to the next one. You know, it's one game at the end of the day. We're down two to one. We play the next game we win. It's tied 2-2. It's a new series. So, you know, shake this one off, get over it quickly and respond in the next one. Sean Shapiro, The Athletic. Hey, John. What, it seemed like you guys were playing pretty well in the first period. What changed going into the second for you guys? Uh, it's playoffs. It's momentum. Uh, we got in our heels uh, a little bit. They... They scored some goals, and uh, yeah, it's hockey. Uh, we're fine. Uh, it's 2 1. We'll move on to the next one. Mike Heike, DallasStars.com. Hey, John, how much uh, does emotion play in this? It seems like the Lightning really got boosted by getting Stamkos back. <laughs> Stanley Cup finals. Can't be more emotional. I mean, I don't know what to answer on that one. Stanley Cup final. Uh, we all play with emotion. Uh, we got our heels a little bit in the second period, but I mean, we're just going to take that momentum back in the next game, uh, come hard at them and, and even the series. Greg Wyshynski, ESPN. Thanks a lot. Hey, Jason, against the Golden Knights, you guys played a lot of flawless hockey, it felt like. Uh, in this series, some penalties you don't want to take, some turnovers that you're making. Is that the Lightning's doing, or, or are these just some mental mistakes on your guys' part? I mean, you can credit it to both, obviously. They're out there playing hard too, right? So um, unacceptable by us to take some penalties that we're taking, and the turnovers, obviously, we got to limit those because it fuels their uh, offensive game. So, um, yeah, we can correct some areas, but... Also, they're a good team. They're here for a reason. So we give them those chances, and they're going to capitalize. Saad Youssef, The Athletic. Hey, Jason. Uh, is it is it realistic to, to kind of draw on, on the previous experiences you guys have had and resilience throughout the playoffs, or, or, is that, or is this just completely different? Oh, yeah, we need to lean on those experiences, right? We got um, – a lot of veteran guys that have been through a lot and we've got a lot of young guys that haven't. So those experiences go a long way in uh, maturing as a player and as a, as a group. So um, if we can draw from those experiences and those situations and uh, reflect on it and say, Hey, we can respond. We've got the guys in here that can do it and we'll be fine. We're not, we're not going to panic yet. Tom Galitti, NHL.com. John, uh, Anton Hudobin has been so good for you guys in the playoffs to, uh, for him to come out of the game tonight. Do you guys feel like he let him down a little bit, just the way he played in front of him? Uh, yeah, well, he's been playing his best hockey and, uh, obviously we want to, we want to keep him, let him do that. But tonight we made some errors and it's hockey and it's sports. So like I said, it's, it's two, one, they're up one. We're going to even the series on Friday. Thanks, guys.